Hi there, I'm Jason Lee. I'm the Chief Information Security Officer here at Zoom. In light of this year's Safer Internet Day on February 9th, we wanted to make a video to help parents and teachers create a safe digital learning experience on Zoom. Here are six key tips you can follow to secure a virtual classroom. One, don't post or let kids post meeting information on social media or other public platforms. This includes the meeting ID, invite link, passcode, or participant ID. This information could potentially help an unwanted guest access to your classroom. Two, make sure everyone is on a stable and secure internet connection. You should use a personal Wi-Fi network that's locked with a password. Three, ensure only legitimate students enter the virtual classroom. For teachers, you can do this by enabling the waiting room feature. This will send everyone to the virtual waiting area where you can admit them individually or all at once. Once everyone's in, you can lock a Zoom session using the security icon at the bottom of your window. For parents, make sure your child doesn't forward along the meeting information to anyone. Four, control screen sharing. Sharing privileges are automatically set to host only for our education users. The teachers are the only ones who can share content in class. However, if students need to share their work with the group, Teachers can allow others to screen share. Click the arrow next to the share screen and then advanced sharing options. Under who can share, choose all participants. You can also toggle sharing privileges under the security icon. Five, remove a participant. If someone who's not meant to be in the virtual classroom manages to join, meeting owners can remove them by using the security icon or from the participant panel. Six, suspend participant activities. If a class is getting disrupted, hosts can click the security icon and select suspend participant activities and temporarily halt all video, audio, in-meeting chat, annotation, screen sharing, and recording, and in breakout rooms. You can resume the class by re-enabling re the individual features. These simple tips provide a safe and fun learning experience for everyone. If you have any further questions about Zoom or security best practices, head to our website and locate additional resources you may need. Happy Zooming!